Hey guys, Devin with 3 Tunes. I just want to give you guys a quick update on the Chato in my sump. It's now been in there for 15 days, so just over two weeks, and the growth is insane. The whole chamber is just about full now with Chato. When I started as my last video, it was about a, a handful about that big. Now almost this entire chamber is full, and that's just been 15 days. And that's all just growing off a 90 watt LED. So if you guys are going to do Chato on something, don't bother with the little CFLs, little curly bobs. If you're going to do it, get something decent or else, in my opinion, it's not even worth it. So I would recommend at minimum get a PAR38 grow light or possibly two of them in your sump. You should see some decent results, but the regular CFLs and those aren't going to do anything. So when you're spending thousands of dollars on reef lighting and you're trying to outcompete LG in the sump, you need something pretty powerful. So invest in something good if you're going to do it and you're going to get awesome growth. So last week, or two weeks ago, I tested and I had about 0 0.07 phosphate. And I tested yesterday and I'm down to 0 0.00. I did test nitrate. Um, it's still in a high range test kit, so it was between 16 and 32. That's with the Red Sea kit. Uh, I was closer to probably, I'm guessing, about mid range a few weeks back. And then yesterday I tested and I was closer to the 16. So it's not 100% gone, but it's definitely putting an impact on it. So if you're going to do it, do it right and invest in some powerful lighting. If you guys like what's going on here, hit the like button, or if you've got any questions, leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe.